Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> we back, y'all. Another episode of the Crypto Millionaire Journey. And um, I hope that you have been watching, that you've been paying attention. The market did a, did a nice little jump there. I hope you, I hope you had your seatbelt buckled in. Did you get a chance to ride the roller coaster? Because, ooh. Man, oh man, we got to talk about this. We got to talk about it. We're talking about within 24 hours. We saw Bitcoin go as high as, what was it, 10000 and a $133 and some change. I believe uh, the final percentages were uh, like, what, 30, 30%? Some, some astronomical number that we had on what was that Thursday night going into Friday morning slash Friday day and for me it's hard not to just watch the price of Bitcoin because it's just been it's been just uh it's been like I said it's been a roller coaster and luckily enough I was able to get in one more time one more time at the what was that the seven thousand five hundred range? I bought like four hundred dollars worth of more Bitcoin, and then I seen it went to like ten k. I said, "Whoa!" I said, "Look at that! That was a quick, easy, just come up." Mm. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna lie though. I had to turn off my trading robot. Can, I'm not trading right now because like Bitcoin's price has been. It's been going up so quickly. I'm like, hey, hey, hey. I'm going to go ahead and turn that off. Because I felt I went back into Bitcoin and it just rode that wave. And I'm like, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's been good. This has been a fun ride. A lot of people thought, oh, we're going to go back to 6,000. Not so fast, my friend. Not so fast. Of course, looking at the market cap right now, we're at 242 billion. We were just at 203. And just boom. But I hope you guys were able to put some money into some coins and catch this little nice rope. This nice wave. It was a nice wave. Nice little run. Like I said, it's hard not to watch the price of Bitcoin because it's just been continuously going up. Goes up, goes down, then goes right back up. I'm waiting to, for the market to kind of readjust so I can turn on my robot back, or my robot back on so he can make some trades. I'm like, whoa, man. I mean, right now you see some reds, but it's just like, whew. What's going on with the market? Some people think it's the whole. China deal with the president and then they got this uh, cryptography law that's getting passed that's going to be effective January 1st 2020 China is coming for the smoke man China wants all the smoke and uh, oof it's going to get interesting so some people are speculating you know that's the reason why we had this little juiced up run here Others say different, but still got to get more. Got to get more. That's a must. And speaking of trading, hoo -hoo -hoo. man, oh man. Been having a good run with that as well. It's bringing in extra funds, extra income. Ooh. I think it gets really scary too, cause I'm gonna start uh, 
I'm gonna hopefully have another account open. Hopefully come November. So next month we're hoping for Whew. Hmm. If we can get another exchange open. Start training on that and have two open. Oh man, because with the thing I got right now, it's I'm at a fifty percent win rate. It's freaking insane. Well, it's funny because I did say, if y'all heard, if y'all listen to my other episodes, I did say October was a key month to see where would Bitcoin head into the holiday season, and it said, you know what? We're gonna take a little ride. Cause October is basically over. Halloween's this week. October's over. November is gonna be here pretty soon, and then it's the real holiday season, December. And then 2020, man, there's there's a lot of a lot of promise for crypto in 2020. It's like I'm just watching the price right now on Binance right now. It's just like. It's at 9200 Earlier today it was at like 9100 All the way down to like 9000 It's just Just constantly just going I'm hoping to see it go possibly back to maybe 95 That'd be kind of nice I can Sell some again Yeah That's what we're hoping Unless it goes back to its 24 hour high, which would be nicer. But, man, that's another thing, too. I, I had another new strategy that has been working for me for when it comes to trading using this robot. And uh, it's been trying to, obviously, once I get a profit, I put in a stable coin and then wait to see if the price of Bitcoin drops again. And then re-enter at that price and grab some more Bitcoin and then get that compound as we go up. So that's going to be, I think, another little check that's going to help to get just extra income, extra, extra. I'm all about the extras right now. I'm all about the extras, but I mean, hmm. 9,000. Bitcoin's at 9,000. It hit 10. It hit 10. Some still think we haven't found that next bottle quite yet. I think people are hoping for the next bottle to be maybe 5,000, 6,000. Yeah. Time will tell. Two times going to tell what's going to happen in the next, what, two months alone. If we had a run like that, ooh. When's the next one? And not just only when's the next one. What price will it go back down to so you can experience this lovely 24 hour just crazy roller coaster game? I mean, when I say I was watching the price, I mean, it was hard not to watch the price. Literally, within seconds, minutes, the whole portfolio is just going up, 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 up. And I'm just like, whoa. It's kind of a surreal feeling. And it's just crazy to see, too. Like, we're talking like $100, $200, $300, just. Those type of games just coming in like boom, boom, boom. I was like, whoa. Whoa, Nelly. Wasn't ready for this. Scratch that actually was because I was able to get in. Like I said, let me go ahead and check because I'm going to check the app to see what was the exact price I had brought in because something told me. That once it got back to like the seven thousand four hundred five hundred range, I was like, I have a feeling like, hey, you know what? It's gonna go back up. 
But, yeah, they went back up with the quickness. So, yeah, I had about, about 0 0.05 Bitcoin at the rate of 75.93. <sighs> yeah. And then all of a sudden it just exploded. Explosion of just gains. Mm. <laughs> Keep trying to tell people, man. Oh, I oh. It's another thing. I've seen some interesting, very interesting tweets today about banks, what they're doing with people's funds. It's just it's it's it's, it's ugly out there, guys. Careful who your bank is. Careful who has all your money. Because we live in a savage world, buddy. Savagery. I'm going to see if I can find them real quick. Ooh, yep, 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 yep. So check out this tweet I had uh, come across. It said, banks across Lebanon are closed for the 10th day in a row. While protests against government corruption continue... It's over a week of not being able to access your own money. Bitcoin isn't a get rich quick scheme. It's a get free quick scheme. Could you imagine not being able to access your funds for 10 days? Like put that in perspective. You cannot, I repeat, you cannot access your funds because there's a freaking protest going on. Like, bro, what? Like, what? Bro, I was surprised that protest hasn't had, like, freaking casualties. You can't access your funds? Could you imagine not being able to access your funds in California for 10 days? It would get scary. It'd be scary. Especially if you got stuff to do. Ooh. Scary times. So that's just one of them. And then there was, let me see. I think there was a normal one. Oh, this was another one. It was interesting too. It said Bitcoin moving 4% in one day tells you one, on a monetary scale, Bitcoin is still tiny. Two, the opportunity is still massive. Owning Bitcoin is still one of the few as the um, as bets that people across the entire world can participate in. Uh, stay woke, stay woke. Whew. Man, I gotta find is there. There was hmm. I'm trying to see if I can find uh, this other. We, I mean, this one was interesting as well. It says, uh, someone tell President Donald Trump that there are only 21 million Bitcoin in China is planning to buy them all. This is going to be the real U.S. China competition. That should get him to pay attention. This guy hates losing. We'll try to buy them all. Uh, I'm telling you, man, China, China's making moves. They're making moves a little low, low when it comes to the crypto. Telling y'all it's gonna get it's gonna get spooky. Huh. Man, oh man. And then there's this. I think there was one more. Let's see if I can find it. Yeah, this guy was over here talking about Bitcoin is now up 3,000 or 40% since yesterday. Yeah. 40% in a day. Again, let's bring out the numbers. Let's just say you had 100K. <laughs> 40%. You would have made 40K. You would have made 40K in a day.
Yeah, 40%, man. 40 freaking percent. So basically, that $400 I had put in, guess how much I had made off that? 40%. It's 160. 160 bounds, buddy. Just poof. One day. Congratulations. Here you go. Forty man, ooh, just imagine two hundred bands. Oh, 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 you would have made eighty k in a day, one day. Boop, eighty k. Forty percent, y'all. One day, I cannot make this up. Can't make it up. Uh, that's why I'm hoping, like, fuck, man. I'm hoping it goes back. To, that's, that's why I'm hoping it goes back at least to 95. Because I'll take it out. I'll take out that 100. Leave the 60 in there. And then just, uh, I'll splurge it real quick, maybe. But, um, uh, November. How is November going to treat us? Hopefully good. Again, I'm, you know what I'm praying for? I've got my fingers crossed for I'm hoping that we see something crazy like back in the 17 during that holiday season when that run oh when Bitcoin hit that 20 yay 20k but time will tell shout out to the mother shout out to the crypto hopper y'all don't know what that is y'all gotta check out the YouTube channel Wolf of Crypto, man. YouTube.com slash the Wolf of Crypto. Check out that Crypto Hopper video, aka playlist, because there's so many videos. Trading Robot, man. I mean, this thing is 24 7, y'all. There's times where I wake up to trades. I already got money. It's been made. It's already been made. Green. I had a 12th streak. 12 kill streak, you know, like, you know, same 12 kill streaks you might do in, like, Call of Duty, Fortnite, or Rainbow Six, wherever shooting game you might be playing. 12 kill streak. Just boom, 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 boom. Green, green, green. Profit, profit, profit. Ah. I said, geez, man, wait. Can you wait till I have some real, real, real funds to play with? Ooh, ooh. Then I'm going to have another exchange. I'm trying to have like four or five exchanges, to be honest. Because there's so many coins and it's... It's 24 7, guys. The market doesn't sleep. There's opportunities every day. There's opportunities to get a bag every day. Hmm. Some people just don't, they don't get it. I don't think they want to get it. I think they're waiting for the other masses. Like, just don't do it. If you wait for the other masses, then it's going to be too late. You didn't know, but, you know, this is stuff I've been preaching. People don't want to listen. I'm trying to tell people, stay woke. If not, you'll regret it, but hey, oh, well. I'm going to go ahead and rack up these coins because, hey, oh, the interest, the compound interest, just the, I mean, I felt that 40% literally everywhere where I had crypto. So it was not just one thing. It was just, just it hit every sector. Boom, boom, boom. It was just, whew. It was as if landmines just went off of money and just poof, explosion, poof. 20 percent 30 percent 40 percent 10 percent it's like whoa and watch him watch your foot watch where you step you you're gonna step in money that's why we gotta keep grinding I'm trying to grinding just ooh tell y'all There's this video that I saw. I'm trying to think what series it is. There's a series on YouTube, man. 
and it's gonna really bother me. I can't think of their that channel's name, but I'm telling you, there's one video where they had like the what was it, like a day in the life of whatever career you might be in, like your job. So one kid was like, oh, "What do you do?" I think he was an Uber driver, and then the other person was like, you know, he traded stocks and all that stuff. The kid that the kid that was trading stocks and stuff, his daily funds or the funds he oh, some like he had made like eleven k I think in like one day. I said, whoa, 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 whoa. And he said he was only playing with thirty thirty racks. I said you're only playing with thirty racks. Yeah, I said, whoa, buddy. I mean, he was making so much to the point where this guy has two houses, a couple of, couple of foreigns, and I'm not just talking about any type of foreign. I'm talking about like the creme de la creme. I'm talking about McLaren. I said, "Oh, he had the McLaren." I said, "Sheesh." Living in Arizona, getting money off the YouTube brand merch. Another dude was a driver for Uber, and it was just like, oof. See, that type of show, like, watching those type of episodes, that was like, eesh. That's tough, because it's like, damn, you got this guy who has a totally different life from this person. But, you know, it's all mentality. They chose, they chose, you know, that path. But, man, I'm glad we're ending October on a good note. And, ooh. We got two more. That's crazy. We got two more months of 2019, y'all. 2019 is almost over. 2019 was just kind of an average year. I'm not going to lie. I'm ready for this shit to be over. 2020 is going to be who? Spooky. But I'm going to go ahead and get on out here until the next, the next time I see y'all. The next time I get on this cast. I'm trying to. Gotta get more episodes out, but kids out here grinding, man. It's nine to five shit. It's boo boo. I gotta get it out the mud. Till the crypto can. Because the crypto's taking me places, man. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I ain't gonna front. Crypto is doing some things. Doing some things for the kid, but I need a little bit more. A little bit more, then. It's gonna really do some things for me. But. Appreciate y'all, you know, tuning in, man. Checking out the podcast. Make sure y'all check out that, uh, check out the YouTube channel, man. I think we just hit, I think I almost hit, uh, I'm almost at, I think, 2.5k subs. We're grinding. Getting it out the mud. I'm gonna have some new, I got another, <clears throat> I think another like channel slash series I'm gonna do, but it's gonna be on another platform. But at the same time, y'all gonna be able to earn, so the the audience has a chance to earn and make some money just for tuning in and sharing. So stay tuned. I'm gonna be talking about that pretty soon. Platform's got a it's got a chance to do some big things. But that's going to wrap it up, man. Appreciate y'all listening to Crypto Millionaire Journey. You know, it's sponsored by yours truly, the Wolf of Crypto. I'm going to have some Wolf of Crypto merch coming out, man. I got to get on my Jordan Belfort stuff, you know what I'm saying? I got to get on my Bobby Axelrod, Bobby Axelrod Billion stuff, man. Y'all don't know who those people are. Those movies are TV series. I oh, got to watch it. But until next time, Duke is out. The Wolf of Crypto is out. Peace, Mm. (laughs) y'all. Keep trying to tell people, man. Oh, I, oh. That's another thing. I've seen some interesting, very interesting tweets today. About banks. What they're doing with people's funds. It's just it's 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 ugly out there, guys. Careful who your bank is. Careful who has all your money. 
Because we live in a savage world, buddy. Savagery. I'm going to see if I can find them real quick. Ooh, yep, 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 yep. So check out this tweet I had uh, come across. It said, banks across Lebanon are closed for the 10th day in a row. While protests against government corruption continue, it's over a week of not being able to access your own money. Bitcoin isn't a get-rich-quick scheme. It's a get-free-quick scheme. Could you imagine not being able to access your funds for 10 days? Like, put that in perspective. You cannot, I repeat, you cannot access your funds because there's a freaking protest going on. Like, bro, what? Like, what? Bro, I was surprised that protest hasn't had, like, freaking casualties. You can't access your funds? Could you imagine not being able to access your funds in California for 10 days? It would get scary. It'd be scary. Especially if you got stuff to do. Ooh. Scary times. So that's just one of them. And then there was, let me see. I think there was a normal one. Oh, this was another one. It was interesting too. It said Bitcoin moving 40% in one day tells you one, on a monetary scale, Bitcoin is still tiny. Two, the opportunity is still massive. Owning Bitcoin is still one of the few asymmetric um, bets that people across the entire world can participate in. Uh, stay woke, stay woke. Whew. Man, I gotta find these. Is there, there was, hmm. I'm trying to see if I can find uh, this other. Tweet. I mean, this one was interesting as well. It says, uh, someone tell President Donald Trump that there are only 21 million Bitcoin in China. is planning to buy them all. This is going to be the real U.S. China competition. That should get him to pay attention. This guy hates losing and will try to buy them all. Uh, I'm telling you, man. China, China's making moves. They're making moves a little low, low when it comes to the crypto. Telling y'all it's gonna get it's gonna get spooky. Huh. Man, oh man. And then there's this. There was one more. Let's see if I can find it. Yeah, this guy was over here talking about Bitcoin is now up 3,000 or 40% since yesterday. Yeah. 40% in a day. Again, let's bring out the numbers. Let's just say you had 100K. <laughs> 40%. You would have made 40K. You would have made 40K in a day. Yeah, 40%, man. 40 freaking percent. So basically, that $400 I had put in, guess how much I had made off that? 40%. It's 160. 160 bounds, buddy. Just poof. One day. Congratulations. Here you go. Forty man, ooh, just imagine two hundred bands. Oh, 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 you would have made eighty k in a day, one day. Boop, eighty k. Forty percent, y'all. One day, 
I cannot make this up. Can't make it up. Uh, that's why I'm hoping, like, fuck, man. I'm hoping it goes back. To, let's laugh. That's why I'm hoping it goes back at least to 95. Because I'll take it out. I'll take out that hundo. Leave the 60 in there and then just, uh, I'll splurge it real quick, maybe. But, um, uh, November. How is November going to treat us? Hopefully good. Again, I'm, you know what I'm praying for? I've got my fingers crossed for I'm hoping that we see something crazy like back in the 17 during that holiday season with that run. Oh, when Bitcoin hit that 20, yay! 20k. But time will tell. Shout out to the mother. Shout out to the crypto hopper. Y'all don't know what that is. Y'all gotta check out the YouTube channel. Wolf of Crypto, man. YouTube.com slash the Wolf of Crypto. Check out that Crypto Hopper video, aka playlist, because there's so many videos. Trading Robot, man. I mean, this thing is 24 7, y'all. There's times where I wake up to trades. I already got money. It's been made. It's already been made. Green. I had a 12th streak. 12 kill streak, you know, like, you know, same 12 kill streaks you might do in, like, Call of Duty, Fortnite, or Rainbow Six, wherever shooting game you might be playing. 12 kill streak. Just boom, 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 boom. Green, green, green. Profit, profit, profit. Ah. I said, geez, man, wait. Can you wait till I have some real, real, real funds to play with? Ooh, ooh. Then I'm going to have another exchange. I'm trying to have like four or five exchanges, to be honest. Because there's so many coins and it's... It's 24 7, guys. The market doesn't sleep. There's opportunities every day. There's opportunities to get a bag every day. Hmm. Some people just don't, they don't get it. I don't think they want to get it. I think they're waiting for the other masses. Like, just don't do that. If you wait for the other masses, then it's going to be too late. You didn't know, but, you know, this is stuff I've been preaching. People don't want to listen. I'm trying to tell people, stay woke. If not, you'll regret it, but hey, oh, well. I'm going to go ahead and rack up these coins because, hey, oh, the interest, the compound interest, just, uh, I mean, I felt that 40% literally everywhere where I had crypto. So it was not just one thing. It was just, just it hit every sector. Boom, boom, boom. It was just, whew. It was as if landmines just went off of money and just poof, explosion, poof. 20%, poof, 30%, 40%, 10%. It's like, whoa. Watch watch your foot. Watch where you step. You, you're going to step in money. That's why we got to keep grinding. I'm trying to grind and just, ooh. I'm telling y'all. There's this video that I saw. I'm trying to think what series it is. There's a series on YouTube, man. And it's going to really bother me. I can't think of their that channel's name. But I'm telling you, there's one video where they had like the, what was it? Like a day in the life of whatever career you might be in, like your job. So one kid was like, oh, what do you do? I think he was an Uber driver, and then the other person was like, you know, he traded stocks and all that stuff. The kid that the kid that was trading stocks and stuff, his daily funds or the funds he oh, some like he had made like eleven k I think in like one day. I said, whoa, 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 whoa. And he said he was only playing with 30, 30 racks. I said, you're only playing with thirty racks. Yeah, I said, whoa, buddy. 
I mean, he was making so much to the point where this guy has two houses, a couple of, couple of foreigns, and I'm not just talking about any type of foreign. I'm talking about like the creme de la creme. I'm talking about McLaren. I said, oh, he had the McLaren. I said, sheesh. Living in Arizona, getting money off the YouTube, he was brand merch. Another dude was a driver for Uber, and it was just like, oof. See that type of show, like watching those type of episodes, that was like, eesh. That's tough because it's like, damn, you got this guy who has a totally different life from this person. But you know, it's all mentality. They chose, they chose, you know, that path. But man, I'm glad we're ending October on a good note. And ooh, we got two more. That's crazy. We got two more months of 2019, y'all. 2019 is almost over. And 2019 was just kind of an average year. I'm not going to lie. I'm ready for this shit to be over. 2020 is going to be who? Booty. But I'm going to go ahead and get on out here until the next, the next time I see y'all. The next time I get on this cast. I'm trying to gotta get more episodes out, but kids out here grinding, man. It's nine to five shit. It's boo boo. I gotta get it out the mud. Till the crypto can. Because the crypto's taking me places, man. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I ain't gonna front. Crypto is doing some things. Doing some things for the kid, but I need a little bit more. A little bit more, then. It's gonna really do some things for me. But appreciate y'all, you know, tuning in, man, checking out the podcast. Make sure y'all check out that, uh, check out the YouTube channel, man. I think we just hit, I think I almost hit, uh, I'm almost at, I think, 2.5K subs. We're grinding, getting it out the mud. I'm going to have some new, I got another, <clears throat> I think another like channel slash series I'm gonna do, but it's gonna be on another platform. But at the same time, y'all gonna be able to earn, so the the audience has a chance to earn and make some money just for tuning in and sharing. So stay tuned. I'm gonna be talking about that pretty soon. Platform's got a it's got a chance to do some big things. But that's going to wrap it up, man. Appreciate y'all listening to Crypto Millionaire Journey. You know, it's sponsored by yours truly, the Wolf of Crypto. I'm going to have some Wolf of Crypto merch coming out, man. I got to get all my Jordan Belfort stuff, you know what I'm saying? I got to get all my Bobby Axelrod, Bobby Axelrod Billion stuff, man. Y'all don't know who those people are. Those movies are TV series. I oh, got to watch it. But until next time, Duke is out. The Wolf of Crypto is out. Peace, y'all.